trails are interesting, but they're not marked, so I have a hard time telling you where we're at when we're on a particular trail, but I'll do, do the best I can. This is uh, an interesting area. Nothing real difficult, but some, uh, some of the trails are technical. And so it's a beautiful day, and we'll have a good time. This is an example of how rocky and technical some of these trails can be. This section here is our climb up to the railroad grade. We continue heading south until we get to the railroad grade, which is basically a, a fire road now. And it's part of 332 or the Prescott Circle Trail. Once we get there, we continue south which is a climb up to another intermediate top, and we follow that east. We're on that trail now, and this is part of the downhill section of that trail. Once we get to the bottom of that downhill, we start an uphill climb that is in a southwestern direction and that's part of this trail now and the following clip is also part of that climb. This is a pretty technical area. You can see the steepness and the rockiness of this area. This is the last part of the climb to the top again going in a southwestern direction and uh, this is certainly the steepest and most difficult part of this climb very technical very rocky Oh, you did it! Good for you. Good job. This is heading, I believe, in a northwest direction, and then it'll turn directly north and take us back down to our railroad grade. And now we head north from here down to the railroad grade and then we'll get a trail that will take us back to the parking area. And here we are back at the railroad grade and we're heading north on this downhill trail and from here we'll hook up 
to a fire road that will take us back to the park. back on the fire road, taking us back to the parking lot, and you'll see the creek bed on our left hand side. And we'll just continue on this until the end and we'll call it a day.